interwebs. How are you doing? It's been so long. Where have you been? Where have I been? It's been like two days or three days. It's been several days. The last time we spoke, there was penguins and a lion with their little tongue out like that. And you know, you would not believe how many people were like upset ethically about me going to the zoo. Listen up. The zoo is the funziest. Do you see my shirt? It's got Harry Pikachu on it. Harry Potter Chew? Potter Chew? I don't know what to call him. Harry Chew? That seems wrong. Harry Chew just seems wrong. Harry Potter Chew. I like it. What else is going on? I made this rainbow dash out of clay. I love her. Isn't she cute? I thought I did a pretty good job. I made her out of clay. If you want to see the other stuff I made out of clay, I'll link it in the video. I'll link the video below. I'm doing a bad job talking. Stanley says hi. Manly. Who's your hands? Oh. Oh. Tell everyone hi. Look at that handsome dog. Look at that handsome dog. What's on the floor? Oh, it's a sheet that you guys pulled off the couch. I usually put a sheet on the couch because Violet has this obsessive licking thing. Like, I've never met a dog who did this. It's really weird. But, like, when she sleeps, she, like, uh, whatever's near her in her sleep, she, like, licks it obsessively. And, like, the couch will get, like, soaked. So we put a sheet on the couch so that she doesn't actually lick the couch, but it looks like Tychus and Stanley have ripped it off for fun. Hi, Karen. I can't. I would show you her, but she's in like a dark corner. She's mysterious. How are you guys doing? Good. Good to hear. If you said bad, I hope it gets better. Funny faces. It looks so bright with my new lights. I feel like I feel like I need SPF to be in the house. I don't though. They're not like lizard lights. They're just. They're actually really cool. A lot of people ask me about them. The box actually says daylight on them. They were kind of expensive. They were like two for $12, which for a light bulb is expensive. Although the box said they would last nine years. I'm trying to look in the lens. The box said they would last nine years. This is really difficult to do. do like full eye contact. Can you handle it right now? Can you handle it right now? Did you guys have a good weekend? I had a good weekend. I just relaxed. Wrote some notes for trade chat this week. That's what I did. I need to do my hair. It's starting to look like a hot mess. I can't decide what I want to do with it though, which is really, that's really the cause of so many problems because I just can't, I just can't decide what to do with it. <laughs> what else is going on? Oh, I have to send some stuff out to my friends like that I made for them. And I'm sending, Dodger told me that she, like her favorite Pokemon card that she has is a Zapdos, but that her holographic Zapdos is messed up. So what a good friend I am. I have this mint condition. Do you see it? It's like perfect Zapdos. Totally sending this to her. I have like a whole pile of Pokemon cards for her. I love her. She's very nice. Um, what else is got? My camera's beeping at me. Stop beeping at me. I don't care that you're turning off. It's going to start beeping really loud. Shut up. Okay. I shut it off. Oh, I got my tattoo worked on. I don't know if you remember, I got this tattoo with my sister and it was just the writing. But the guy wrote it all crooked and sloppy and not very nice. So I went and had it redone and I had some clouds put around it and it says, if it hasn't worked out, it's not the end. And my sister has my sister has, it will all work out in the end, and then I have, if it hasn't worked out, it's not the end. And we got it because our dad has cancer, and it's kind of like an everyday reminder that no matter what, things are going to be okay. Because that's kind of what I stand for in life. That no matter what, things are going to be okay. My dad's going to Florida on, I think he's leaving on Valentine's Day, and he's going to go fishing, and that'll be really fun for him, and I'm sure he's going to have a great time. And the Giants won the Super Bowl, which I don't know if you watched it. I thought it was so hysterical because I watched it online because they did it online this year. And as soon as the Giants won, the screen immediately changed to Giants stand tall again. And me personally from watching the game, I really think that the title should have been Giants win by sitting down because that's what happened. Number 44 sat down in the end zone. He literally like plopped his little butt down. And you know, I'm really glad for him. I don't know what player he is. I don't really follow football that closely, but I was like half watching. I don't know who he is in particular, but how horrible would he feel? Like, cause he wasn't supposed to put it in the end zone. He was supposed to get it close and then 
the anticipation was they would get tackled. But the Patriots wanted an extra minute to try to score a touchdown, so they kind of just let him go, and he wasn't expecting it. And he, like, gets to the end zone and, like, doesn't know what to do. And he, like, stopped and kind of, like, wobbled and, like, sat down in the end zone and got a touchdown. It was... It was kind of hysterical in, like, a great way. So I'm really glad because if they had, if Tom Brady had, like, made a touchdown happen, which he tried, and his receivers, awful, awful. If your hands touch the ball, you should catch it. And two times their hands touched the ball and they dropped it. You don't drop the ball in the last minute of the Super Bowl. If I was your coach, I would fire you. I'm sorry. Um, this is why I'm not a football coach. Yee. Anyways, the Giants won. And I'm happy for number 44 that he won the Super Bowl instead of lost the Super Bowl. Because had there been a goal in that last minute, it would have been all of his fault. And everybody would have hated him. And we don't need any more hate in this world. No, we don't. Everybody just needs to focus a lot more on getting along. Because we're all, like, the same. Like, even if, even if... Even if everybody's got like a different circumstance and everybody's in a different situation, but deep down, we're all... We're all the same. We all, like get sad over the same types of things and get angry over the same types of things but so many people are so worried about their own problems that they don't realize that maybe the reason that someone's acting the way they are is because they have a similar problem that they deal with differently than you do so I don't know inspirational random moment and I'm sorry about that um I'm hungry I haven't eaten all day so I think I'm gonna go eat that's happening and that's about it so I hope you guys are having a great day. I hope you have a great tomorrow, although we should talk tomorrow. You should call me. Call me. Okay, I'm going to go now, guys. I hope you're having a great day. I love you all. You're in my hearts. I'll see you soon. Bye.